So we're joined by head coach of the under-17 reggae girls, Hugh Bradford. Coach, firstly, how has preparation been leading into the upcoming games against Panama? Um, you know, times were short that we had with the players, but um, there have been improvements um, over the days that I've seen. Um, so it's as good as we could get with the time that we had. Yeah, and I'm sure, you know, in terms of the sum up of our national team, seeing the senior girls and the performances they gave at the World Cup, must be an inspiration to these under-17 girls as well and say, I can be there one day. Absolutely, because that's the first question I asked when I met with the players for how many of you were watching and everybody's hands went up. And, you know, you could see smiles on their faces of, you know, yeah, we were very proud. And you could see, and what I told them was, you know, hey, one day that could be you. You're U17s now, but the next cycle, some of you could be looking to be a part of that group. Yeah, and of course, you're in the Dominican Republic with the under 20s as well, and they also had some historic moments, first time defeating a Central American team. So, all around, for the girls, there's been strides along the way. Yes, definitely. You know, the, with the 20s, it was it was really good group uh, of players. Uh, we had some challenges, you know, with exams and different things, but you know what? We, they made no excuses and they went out and very, very proud of them because they went out and really gave everything that they had to represent the country well and to represent themselves and their families well. So that was very good. Yeah, and finally, Coach, in terms of your message to Jamaica for these upcoming games here at Savannah Park to come out in their numbers and to the next generations of Bonnie Shaw's, Trudy Carter's, etc. <laughs> well, you know, my message is um, come out and support the females playing. Um, these young ladies are working really hard. They have a lot of pride in themselves and they want to represent their co their country. They want to represent the badge. And so please come out and support them. And you know, not just for the game, but continually in the future, support them because they, they need the support. And the more we support them as a country, the better they're gonna be. And the more we're gonna see the success and the talent come forward because they'll have backing of in an entire country.